Karya came and found us just in time. Oh, there they are! Varamdra, thank goodness you're all right. Thank you so much, Miss Guide. Oh, didn't I tell you to wait for me? <coughs> Judging by the changes in the water's surface, the path to the mysterious island wouldn't be around for long. I, I didn't want to miss this opportunity. It's just... I, uh, I didn't expect my calculations to be wrong. It seems you were right. Right? Who knows if we can make it back in time now? Huh? All the whirlpools have disappeared! Seems we missed our chance. Why would you give up on such an opportunity to come rescue me? How can you say that? It's already bad enough that you had to be left behind. Do you think I'd let anyone in my group drown? Oh. I'm really sorry. Don't feel guilty, Karia. I think if I reactivate the nodes, that will cause the whirlpools to reappear. The only problem is that we still don't know exactly when we'll be able to do that. It's already getting late now, and we've been on the move for a whole day. As your guide, I suggest we make camp first and have a good meal. We can talk about the other stuff tomorrow. Now that you mention it, Paimon is feeling a little hungry. Hey, Paimon's stomach can be very sensible. It won't interrupt while everyone's busy solving puzzles. We have plenty of tasty things to eat. Let's just find a suitable spot to make camp. Hmm, I like that place right over there. Is this the spot? Let Paimon and the Traveler help set up the tent. Go ahead, I'll take care of the fire. Oh, and here's a little camping tip. It's best to set the tent upwind from the campfire. I can't believe there was an error with my theory. Is there anything I can help with? I must thank you all for saving Varamja earlier.